Look, some wondercraft is moving very fast above the water's surface. What is it? Airplane? Speedboat? No, this is neither the one, nor the other. It's a cranoplan. High speed, wind and ground effect craft. The phenomenon of ground effect was primarily noticed in the middle of 1920s decade by airplane pilots. The pilots just lost control at the closing stage of their landing, in immediate proximity to the ground, when the air under the wings becomes compressed. The nature of the phenomenon was not understood at the time, but it got a name – air cushion. Some time later, the phenomenon was studied in depth and got a more scientific definition, such as the ground proximity effect. However, since the phenomenon was evident not only above the ground, but above water as well, the surface effect term became more widespread. The history of Ekranoplan building began many decades ago. Many Russian scientists, as well as scientists all over the world, was engaged in Ekranoplan construction. But the priority in the development of thinking ground effect crafts belongs to Soviet scientist and distinguished designer shipbuilder Rostislav Alexeyev. He was the first designer who created a transport vehicle capable to move over the water with the speed up to 500 km per hour. Alexeyev's science achievements was generally recognized in Soviet Union and got worldwide acknowledgement as well. Unfortunately, development of the Kranoplan technology was practically halted since the times of collapse of the Soviet Union. But in 1992, Alexeyev's nearest collaborators and followers united into JC Arctic Trade and Transport Company Enterprise, which was able to save and develop achievements of domestic Kranoplan building. Thanks to efforts and investments of the company founders, the infrastructure of Chkalovsky Center for Kranoplan Building has been restored in a short time. Now it is a production and test complex of the JC Arctic Trader Transport Company, where many of high-skilled specialists are working. At present days, company includes enterprises, which are able not only to develop new types of Kranoplans, but also can accomplish their serial production using most advanced technology. The company's design bureau is situated in the city of Nizhny Novgorod, Russia's third largest city. The production and test complex is situated in Chkalovsk city. Akoglite 5 Ekrana plant is being produced at manufacturing plant now. The test facilities include big testing pool and wind tunnel, where mock up of future Ekrana plants are being tested with the aim of calibration of air and hydrodynamic characteristic of design of vehicles. Moreover, the bays have direct outlet to the Gorkovsky Reservoir, used by the company as testing area for a kind of plant. Aquaglide 5, the first civil sea ekranoplan, was developed by the specialists of the Arctic Trade and Transport Company in full compliance of the requirements of Russian Maritime Register of Shipping and International Maritime Organization. Aquaglide 5's cruising speed is of approximately 170 km per hour and equitable with speed of a helicopter or a speed train. And at the same time, Aquaglide consumes less than 32 liters of gasoline for each 100 kilometers, like some big truck. The Kranoplan moves above water at very little altitude, from 15 to 35 centimeters, and houses four passengers and one pilot navigator. Ecoglide 5 has the certificates of International Maritime Organization and the Russian Maritime Register of Shipping. Intellectual property is covered by Russian and foreign patents. While floating, the Kranoplan doesn't cause any accelerative forces, which are quick to planes or surface ships. There are not any high-speed craft providing such a comfort. Amphibious characteristics of this flying ship allow it to put into waterside grounds and shoals without assistance. Also, Ecoglide 5 can easily move to and start from relatively unprepared surface and operate in shallow water. Ecoglide 5 is all-season craft. It feels good moving not only above water, but above snow or ice-crusted surface as well. Moreover, it's also able to move about ground, grass, sandbank, beach. In short, it can move about any relatively smooth surface. Such capabilities allow the Ekranoplan to operate where other craft can. Ecoglide 5 Ekranoplan is an environmental friendly craft. Traveling close to the surface air boundary, the Ekranoplan causes no waves or any other disturbance, doesn't damage sea flora and fauna, and doesn't erode banks of rivers and lakes and seashores. 
Moreover, the operation of the Aquaglide 5 does not demand specific infrastructure as ports, cranes and moorings. This property gains a side benefit in places with poor infrastructure on islands, shallow water and problem water area. Their unique capabilities and unorthodox appearance make the Kranoplans suit for use in various purposes short and medium-range sea or river taxi for fast delivery of passengers and cargo, sports and recreation, including diving, hunting, sport fishing, alien tours, environment protection and coastal patrolling, rescue operations. EcoGlide 5 is quite simple for use and steer, as it considers aboard only minimal training and navigator license are enough to operate it. Today, the experts of the company are sure the Kranoplans are able to keep a niche between fast but expensive air traffic and slow but more cheap sea traffic. The Kranoplans are confidently coming over all ships and airplanes at transport routes up to 2000 miles. The wing and ground traffic technology will allow to improve world transport strategy in the nearest future. In nowadays, JSC Airtrain Trading Transport Company is the up-to-date, highly developed company. There are a lot of projects of passenger ekrana plants of different applications in its portfolio, which are capable to meet requirements of any customers. We are convinced that scientific collaborations and technologies realized in ekrana plants of JSC Airtrain Trading Transport Company are able to change the development strategy of international transportation in the nearest future. We invite all interested partners for cooperation.